These people are no longer passers-by. The year is 1980, the month is July, and the place is Alverston, Cumbria. Not that that'll help you much. The assistant in this electrical goods shop is not helping me much, either. She is not happy. She's not happy that a crowd has gathered for reasons other than her manager's special offer, or the promise of a free clock radio or steam iron when you sign up for a new washing machine or dishwasher. And she's certainly not happy that I'm taking photographs. She kicks me out. So what are they looking at? A live dog trapped in a tumble dryer? No. It's Wimbledon on the telly. The men's singles final. Bjorn Borg of Sweden, the ice-cool bass liner, versus John McEnroe, irascible of America, serving and volleying. Across the country, everyone, it seems, well, everyone except that shop assistant, is caught up in the excitement. Indeed, a quarter of a century on, some say that this tie-break in the fourth set was the most exciting 22 sporting minutes ever. Borg saved six set points, and McEnroe saved five match points before going on to win it, 18-16. And even though he lost the match in the fifth set, handing Borg the title, John McEnroe says his professional life was never so much fun again. Was this the greatest game of lawn tennis ever played? Probably.